Hi guys, here is Kathy from Kathy Director and in this new Photoshop tutorial I show you how you can make our great wallpaper effect like this. It's very easy. And now let's get started. First, open a new document with click on File and New. Then use any settings you want. Next, double click to unlock your layout. Then go to Filter, Render and Fibers. Here you set the vari variance on 16 and the strength on 4. OK. Then Filter, Blur, Motion Blur. There set you the angle to 90 and the distance to the highest you can get. OK. And now you can uh, make it again if you want or leave it till you get your background you want. Next go and double click on your layer. Go to gradient overlay. Click on the, the tab gradient overlay. Blend mode to overlay. Gradient. You can any use any gradient you want. I have a rainbow gradient. Set the angle to 180 so you get this effect here. You can play around if you want. So I want any color on it. Click OK. Now choose your re uh, rectangle marquee tool and select the top to the middle like that where you want to have a line. So a little shadow in the middle. Next hit Ctrl C, Ctrl V. You get a second layer with the black and white. Go to the layer 1 and right click and go to copy layer styles. Paste the layer styles into layer 1. Double click on the layer to open the layer style options. And here you go to drop shadow. Click on the drop shadow tab. Set the opacity high you want, maybe 100. The spread to 10 and the size to 20 but you can change anything you want click OK now we have this here click on the text tool write your text now you can double click on the text layer click on stroke and set the stroke to white and then go to bleeding options default, fill opacity to 80 and the bleeding mode to overlay. You can sh change it so with the fill opacity to high and to low what you want. And that is my tutorial. I hope you enjoyed it. For comment. And if you have tutorial suggestions then let it me on in the comments or on my moderator tool on my channel or write in the channel comments or message me so yeah that's all and see you next time bye